friends. Thank you for breathing with me today. Let's take a big deep inhale through the nose and a big exhale through the mouth. Or with that breath, if you've got some congestion, breathe however you need to. If you need to take a deep inhale through the mouth and exhale through the mouth or through the nose and exhale through the nose, whatever works for you. So let's go ahead and check in with our beings. So check in with our breathing, check in with our bodies, our emotions, check in with our energy, check in with our mindset, and then check in with our spirit. So checking in with that body, how is your body feeling? Um, I am recovering or getting over this cold, whatever it is that's been going around, um, and it's been coming on and off, so I'm checking in with my body. Some of my areas feel okay. Some of my body areas don't feel okay. Um, checking in with my breathing. How is my breathing doing? And so if you have upper respiratory or a respiratory thing going on, your breathing might be a little bit compromised. So checking in with that. Remember, all of this affects even your mind. It affects your mindset, mental stuff, mental barriers. It affects all of that. Check in with your energy. My energy is waning. It has, it's not as high as it normally is, and I am recognizing that because of being sick. Um, checking in with my emotions. How are my emotions? What are my emotions? What am I feeling? And then marrying that with being sick as well. So remembering to bring that into the conversation and bring that, give yourself some credit that you might be feeling extra down and you're like, why, why am I so depressed? It's your body is depressed because maybe you're fighting something off. If you're sick, if you're not, just keep checking in with those emotions. And remember, you can use an emotions chart um, or find a, a, a feelings list. Uh, that can be very helpful. Check in with your mindset. How is your mindset doing? Are you able to change it? And then checking in with our spirit. And that's our number one. Our number one, our foundation is our spirit. So checking in with that, making sure that you've had some spiritual nourishment, even when you're not feeling well anywhere else, using getting that spiritual nourishment, spending some time in the Bible, spending some time in prayer, meditation, in worship with God, um, vital and essential and foundational. Let's do a few sun breaths here and breathe ourselves into this day. So let's inhale and you can use your arms. I'm gonna use my arms, inhale it up and exhale it out. And inhale it up and exhale it out. And one more time, inhale it up and exhale it out. And if you have been ill, if you've been sick, you might want to add in, you don't need to use a lot of movement, but you might want to start, if you're starting to get up and around, you might want to add in a little bit more movement, a little bit more rotation with your breathing. Maybe you're standing, maybe you can stand up and rock yourself back and forth while you breathe. Um, I'm gonna add a little bit of arm rotation with our next three breaths. So I'm gonna inhale and sweep this up. And as I exhale, I'm going to drop that and give myself a little bit of a twist. It'll be four breaths actually, so that we get two on each side. So inhale it up and a little twist on the other side. Two more breaths, inhale it up and twist that over and inhale it up and twist that over and then maybe do that check-in again so check in with your beings check in with your body check in with your breathing check in with your energy check in with your emotions check in with your mindset and check in with that spirit and even after just doing a few of those breaths it or yeah a few of those breaths it it opened up cleared up my chest a little bit cleared up my nose a little bit just that can help too. That can help change that mindset. It can help bring you back into your window of tolerance even when you are sick, even when you are ill. Because I, for in my personal experience, I tend to go way out of my window of tolerance when I'm sick. Um, I either go super duper low or I get kind of a little manic, like what's going on? Um, so 
and it lasts a little bit longer. So I have to recognize that and process through that and work through that so that I bring myself back in. I may not be feeling here, but I am acknowledging that I can bring myself here and that if I'm up and out, it's okay. Give myself, my body some time to keep continuing to recuperate, recover, and get back into a little bit of normalcy. So thank you for breathing with me and um, keep breathing, keep going through your checklist, keep normalizing whatever is going on with you if you've got some illness going on. And we'll see you next time.